All right, hey there, everyone. Welcome back to Little Nightmares. Oh, uh, I have no idea what to say. <laughs> I guess it's nice to see you again, and we're gonna continue Little Nightmares. I think we are now in the Pale City. Is Pale City the real name of this place? I don't know. We just exited a very weird hospital area where we kind of cooked the doctor inside the morgue. It was crazy, so don't ask me. Let's just jump and continue and see what happens. All right. Gotta get comfy. I don't hear any music. Okay, starting, nice. So let's check the chapters. No, I don't want to exit. Chapter selection. Okay. So we had the beginning area, the school, the hospital, and now the city. I haven't been doing well with collectibles, to be honest. I couldn't find any hats most of the times. Uh, I didn't want to go to the chapter. I hope it didn't save. That would suck. I think it did. Right? Yeah, this looks kind of wrong. I messed up. Okay, let's see chapters. Do I start everything from the beginning? Yeah, okay, no. No. Please don't tell me I'll have to replay everything. That would suck. Yep. They really saved the checkpoint here? Wait. Oh, I'm so stupid. Okay, I guess we'll have to start from here. Which sucks. But hopefully we remember everything. Actually, I don't, but we'll see. Bale City is... Pretty nice. It's has much, much more space than others. Others felt a little bit more claustrophobic. I'm still a little mad that I pressed restart from checkpoint. I don't know why. I guess I'm just stupid. So all we're gonna do is just run, speed run this place. <laughs> You just need falling characters, oh my god. Oh yeah, we'll have to do like TV teleportations and stuff. Oh, that's gonna be fun. Oh my god! Hello? Nice! He really wanted to be the part of that world, huh? How come I don't remember these places? My memory is so bad. Oh, hey man! It's the nep to you as well.
fancy meeting you. So I'm an idiot. This game has checkpoints and chapters. And instead of just loading my latest ch checkpoint, I loaded a whole chapter. So I'm starting everything like from beginning of a certain chapter. So that kind of sucks. Hello, sir. What the fuck are you doing? He's he's doing naughty things. I think he's just peeking. Ah, never mind. Let's go. Ignore. Actually, no, they're not from Creators of Limbo, but uh, I understand why you would uh, have that kind of a guess. I think this one's created by Bandai Entertainment. I don't really remember that well. But yeah. I'll have to speed run it, but the problem is I don't even remember it well. Hello, lady. Yeah, they kill you, but... Yeah, the successor was inside. I remember you playing it at work. It was very weird to watch you play Limbo at work. Okay, what do you, what we have to do here, I wonder? We have a bucket. Okay, let's let's get a boost. Nice. Everybody's watching TV. It's messed up. I like these horror games that they're like not scary at all. They're just very um, atmospheric and ethereal, if, if I can say that. It's very pretty made, let's say it like that. I remember this elevator part. Took me a while to understand what to do here. Okay, gotta go here. Now we jump to the left. Whoa! That was a very bad jump. I mean, jump scares are kind of like cheap way of scaring people, I guess. I don't really like them as much. Some of them are definitely like uh, well placed, so those I can give a give a pass or something. All right, we gotta get a key. Key. Let's go. One thing that I understood but while playing these games is that I'm not as good at puzzles. It, they do take me a while to like understand. says yeah but usually it's basically laziness creating a horror game and it's basically 100% jump scares well worked for five uh, nights at freddy's but uh, that one i guess had a unique mechanic oh yeah i mean what what kind of game they created where they allow you to like customize the whole scenario that's probably like the coolest part <laughs> Bring it up. We're gonna jump on top of the thing. Oh fuck! 
You want to replay Portal 2? Damn. You want to hear a secret? I've never played any of the Portal games. I have no idea, like, how it goes there. I only know the character, like, the robot, because it's been referenced throughout many, many different games. I think uh, I heard about Portal through... What was that game called? Not Killing... Killing Floor? I think it's called Killing Floor, the zombie game. You must play them right now. Check it out, the huge city. It's called the Pale City, I think. Yeah, I feel like I should definitely play it, and I'm, I would be curious to see. Is it also... Would you consider it like as a mainly puzzle game? Okay, help me up. Killing Floor was nice, but pretty mid. I mean, it's just a simple zombie game. It, th these are kind of games where you can play any time. Usually they're very good for me because I often am too tired to play video games. It's like I start but I can't get myself into the story. I really want to be present, so... And then I'm like, okay, what can I do? I can shoot some zombies and end the day. Yeah, I'm mostly curious about the story, to be honest. Okay, I'll need your help, buddy. Come on, Billy! Push me up, Billy! Billy! No, seriously, Billy, what the fuck? Bring me up. Nice. Sec, let's do something to make things more comfortable. Got a drink. Dance is the story is damn good. The portal one was like prototype, but the second one really explodes on storytelling. But the first one has a, 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 a story which is quite nice and spawned a lot of memes at the time. Man, I feel like I missed it. Like I missed that uh, chapter. But even today, I still see memes from Portal. Isn't like the cake is a lie originated from Portal? That whole thing? It's not necessarily a meme, it's more of an easter egg thing. But yeah. Ooh, I don't like the cracking. I think things are gonna start breaking. Oh fuck, they are breaking. Oh shit, we gotta run. Push it, Billy! Push the door! Yes! Okay, we survived. For now! Run! <laughs> oh my god! Are we gonna make it? Nope. We're so dead. Oh, that was supposed to happen, okay. No, Billy, what the fuck, man? Don't tell him he's dead. Billy, come on, get the hell out of here. Okay, he's good. Jesus, I thought I lost the character. Oh man, this is no good. Sure, you're okay. Okay, never mind. Oh, I'm looking forward for someone to kill me now. 
Oh man. There's so many like hidden messages in this game. I played the first game, like Little Nightmares 1. I had no idea what the story is all about. It's just so freaking deep. And all these little details showing everywhere on the map of like these eyes watching you and TV and everything like that. Basically, TV is evil. This is where, like, inside feels very similar to this because it has an Orville vibe of, like, mind control and stuff like that. Okay, I have to align the corridor, I think. Let's see. I have no idea what I'm doing. Why does it fail? Okay, we got it. I didn't even know these games existed? Well, I guess you can try them. They're not as long. Oh, we got the classic Dutch tilt. We're gonna go to the door. Oh, fuck. There's definitely going to be something behind it. Let's go. Hello? Man, it's Bane! It's freaking Bane! Oh man! Well, as long as he doesn't come out. Thanks, man. It was very nice to see you here. Have a nice trip back home. Oh, fuck. Oh. <laughs> okay. Let's go. Run. Oh, my God. We have Slenderman. Look at this guy, oh my god, it's like, I kind of want him to catch me. Okay, I really asked for it. Come on, bro. Get up, get up, get up, get up. No time to lose from this ring, creep. What the hell is going on? Like, why the TV? Why is this guy coming out of it? Oh fuck! Billy, that's a very shitty hiding spot. Come here. Man, he's gonna get caught. I told you so! Run! Oh, that's the end of... That's the end of Billy. Oh my god! Billy became the glitch. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Now we're all alone. Man. They didn't hesitate taking away your companion. Fucking TVs. Why would I even want to do that? Well, that's mega trippy. La 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 la. I guess we gotta climb up. Let's see. Come on! <sighs> I can hear another TV. Nice. Okay, cool. 
Cool, we have teleportation now. It's one small problem. I won't be able to get back. Wait. Oh, there's like this uh, platform that I can jump and open the door. No problem. Nice. Now we can do the spin thing. I guess that the reason why they call this pale city is because everyone's just... Oh, I survived? Wow, impressed. It's because nobody has face in this city. Everyone's just like brainwashed by the television. By the Slender Man. What the hell am I doing? I don't understand myself sometimes. All right, with the power of teleportation, let's go! Whoa, they weren't kidding about the transmitting radio waves. Moving pictures. You're probably like, what the hell is he saying? I don't know either. Don't... Oh man, when I see like those cracked boards, I expect the worst. Ah, oh, the classic hooks. That's... Sorry though. Okay. Man, is it safe to drink water? That water looks tasty. Here's another plank that looks like it has a crack in the middle. Okay, there's the TV, a remote. Oh, nice! Whoever watched TV disappeared here. It's just clothing left. Okay, let's go. Nice. What the hell? Okay, nothing here, honestly. Okay, um... Yeah? Cheap viewers, why would I want to buy viewers? <laughs> oh, thanks, mate. Oh, that's convenient. Okay, now I need to go on the other side. Can we jump through this? Oh man, I really suck at jumping. Have to go all the way. Man, the world is crazy these days. Buy viewers? For what? Like, what's the reason? To get fake viewers. I mean, I don't understand the principle of like... Uh, I wonder how it's actually called. 
like I think it's called the principle of the herd. When you see so many people at one place, you kind of want to join and to be part of it. So if you see numbers how large, there's gonna attract more viewers. So maybe. Okay, please don't fuck up. Nice. Okay, cool. We passed it safely. Man, I'd love to do this in real life. Just slide down. Maybe not the, with the clothing rack, because I will definitely fall. But you know what I mean. I used to do those things as a kid. Hello, lady? Oh! Oh, no! Oh, shit! <laughs> oh, yeah, she's pissed. We should not turn off TV for them. No turning off TVs. So I'm basically safe if they have something to stare at. What could be so important in that static? Oh, there's another TV. Okay, awesome. I guess we have to turn this off. Let's hide in the oven. Oh dear lord. I think it's watching the other television. Yeah, we're good. Look at that goddamn face. Jesus Christ. Oh, we gotta teleport through there. I bet if we paused and looked at each of the static image that was showed during teleportation, there'll be more hidden messages. But to be honest, I'm not really into diving with to the to see all the iceberg or something. Oh, please don't loan me from the beginning. That would suck. Thank you. Hello, sir. I need your TV. Um. Oh, oh my god, what? Jesus. These guys are gonna do anything for the television. Game's just trying to scare me. I ain't scared. Oh, the bathtub. Let's get in. This would be huge, man. Imagine having a huge bathtub. That'd be great. This freaking scene. Man. They're all just jumping. It's horrible. I think I'm gonna. Oh my god, I'm dead. Uh, 
I don't know how that helps, but... Open this and we run. Oh yeah, no fucking hell! Run! Jesus! The old grandpa! Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it! Faster! Oh my god, I can't believe I electrified him. And killed myself. Oh man. I have to do it again? No! Man! That's not why they pay me to do this. I don't take joy in electrifying creepy old men. This time he got so much closer. Okay, we have to turn it off. Guys, do you like my hat? Look at it. Fancy. I feel like a sheriff. Okay, we got an elevator. Push it! Push! Yeah! Oh man, it stinks everywhere. We need to take a shower. It's not enough evil stuff and ghosts. I don't like ghosts. I don't like them. What are we actually going to do with this elevator? I think it's broken on the second floor. Well, either way, I need some sort of additional platform to reach that thing, because... Because Timmy, I mean Billy, died. That's all you're gonna open for me? Damn. What? Do I see fingers? Oh my god, we're being observed. What do you want from me? Leave me alone. Okay, that literally gives us nothing. What are we supposed to do? I'm gonna try to bring the elevator up, but I don't think we can exit. No, 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 no. Thank God. All that traveling for televisions does really go well with my stomach. There's the possibility to get in between the... In between the floors? That would be my guess. But I have no idea. Oh, hey, Lou! Welcome! I don't know, I guess I'm doing all right. Nothing, uh... Nothing else to say, to be honest. I'm just trying to figure out this puzzle. I'm playing Little Nightmares 2. It's a horror game, but it has a lot of puzzle elements. So, I'm in a location where we have an elevator. And I think we need to somehow manage to go in between the floors, because... Basically, we have the special power that we can travel through television. Oh, you know the game. Have you played it yourself? Okay, I think 
this is the floor that I need to go to, but the gates are closed. Oh, I think I understand. I think I finally understand. Okay, check it out. We have to go up. And we're gonna jump on top of the elevator. You played it and finished it. Awesome. I actually don't know how much game I have left. Okay, come on, let's go! I gotta go on top! There we go! Oh my god! That's so awesome! And we are in the second floor! Okay, low. sorry bother my manners. How have you been? Congratulations again on finishing school. Uh, you also told me you've been on vacation, so that sounds like an awesome activity to do together with your family. So now that you're back, how are you doing? What, how are you enjoying your summer? Hello? Is this Molly the dolly? Ah, can I take this? Aha! You're coming with me. Can I take it? Never mind. Oh, you're making some money. Oh, damn. You got some job? Some kind of a job? Or you're working for your parents? Oh, man. I assume you have some kind of like a uh, goal to purchase. I would assume it would be a car, maybe? Okay, let's not jump into the tub, let's jump on the other side. Oh man, that was so close. Oh wait, look, we can go through here, can we? No, never mind. Oh man, we're gonna deal with more pale people. They're so creepy. No, come on, you want me to electrify her? Do I even have anywhere to go to? There's the plug. Yeah, man. Mm, that's not what I should be doing, I guess. I mean, I see the plug. I cannot get to the plug. Can I take the chair? No, if you don't like me taking the chair. Oh, man. Anyway, Lo says. But there's one really... There's one thing really hindering you? Okay. You have an injury in your knee. When you walk it hurts and you use your knee a lot. I mean, yeah, that's... I could understand that. I also feel like sitting down, for example, right now it hurts because your job is physically demanding. You have to walk a lot and carry stuff. Oh man, that sucks. So... Did you got injured? Or your knee just started somehow from nowhere to hurt. Because maybe you got like, uh, because you had to do a lot of labor, maybe you strained your knee or something. Okay, clearly we need to. Can we jump from here to toilet? Oh, come 
on. Where do I jump then? Okay, so my thought process here is probably I need to jump onto the toilet again. But I keep failing. So maybe it's impossible to jump on the toilet? Can we jump into the bathtub? I think we're missing something. We need to like look around more. There's a chair. You're getting a surgery? What? Seriously? It's like a small piece of bone loose on the undersides of your knee joint. Ow! That sounds so uncomfortable. You will remove it and replace it with something else. You get all the details of Sanji and Marudi. Oh my god. That is very unfortunate. I'm very sorry to hear that. But I'm glad you're gonna get it fixed, you know? So that you could have comfort again. Especially now that you have to work. How do I get past this area? Okay, I think I got it. What? It still takes the chair from me? Because, yeah, it's still very weird that something like that would happen. I would imagine you would should have like some sort of childhood trauma or some sort of like uh, genetic... Uh, inheritance from your parents to have uh, some sort of mm, like knee problems yeah it's better later than uh, than getting into surgery with unexperienced doctors Yeah, your mom has weak knees. Okay. That makes more sense, maybe. Okay, so I really don't know what to do here. I assume I need to get, like, the chair. Remember struggling on this part as well, okay. It's weird because... There's like a bar of soap. Trying to get the chair. Yeah, 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 but uh, do I really need to do it that way? I think I need to lure it to be electrified here.
I'll try it again, I guess. Yeah, that bar is just decoration. Okay. But like, I can't really push it far, I get killed by her. So it's definitely not the way to go. Anyway, dude. How's your driver's license going? Like, uh, lessons and everything. What if you turn off the TV when she is all the way on the other side of the room? Like, like the right bottom corner. I mean, I can try. Oh my god. Okay, that actually worked. Man, you're a genius. Wrong way. Wrong way, mama. Oh my god. Oh, so you're gonna have your license probably this summer. By the end of the summer. That's awesome. You should be very excited, I think. Well, at least, uh, at least they know what to do. I don't know how I managed to survive that. I remember I used to have these uncontrollable shakes, so I would get so nervous. I even have, like, I got my license from the second exam, because the first time... It was like, first, like perfect conditions. This was a sunny day, no rain, very little cars actually. But I was just so nervous by the fact, the idea of going on an exam that my body was like shaking. And uh, we were doing like the exam part that is in the parking lot. And accidentally when you have like that uh, platform that you have to drive in 30 degrees and stop your car. And then without rolling back, you have to go up. So accidentally, I don't know why I pulled the, I pulled the clutch, not the clutch, how is it called, the transmission. Uh, there are different ways how to put in a reverse. So on this car, if you clutch it up and put it in the first uh, gear position, then it goes backwards. And I rolled backwards and it was like immediately the, the critical mistake. I was like surprised, but the instructor was super nice. He was like... Well, you did get like this uh, 
critical mistake, so you fail your exam. But if you want, we can go through all the exams so that you would experience and know things. So we did all the other uh, tasks. We went to the city, drove around, got back. Well, said I'm sorry, but that's the way it is. And then the second time, the second time I uh, like I got my license, but it was everything was completely opposite. It was raining, there was a lot of cars in the town, and my instructor was super mean to me. I don't know, I was like, oh my god. I was sure that I'm not gonna get licensed because just my odds were against me. But I don't know. <laughs> I did all the things I was asked by the instruction instructor, I didn't get any critical mistakes, and I passed. I was like, what? It was crazy. Come on. I mean, honestly, even if you get your exam, you really don't know how to drive. At least, at least that's my opinion, because I still like, you know, there's a reason why you get like the, the green leaf badge, let's call it. That you cannot like drive faster and stuff because you still need experience. I think I gotta focus on this one, I just can't seem to do it anymore. Not a single push. I don't really think it's that supposed to be that difficult. Okay, we got a little bit this time. Oh god. Oh come on! It's so freaking hard. What is this part? This is freaking lady, man. What the hell is going on? Ah, ah, ah. I don't know. She just doesn't care, man. She wants her TV. We keep turning it off for her. Huh, <sighs> okay. Keep trying, I guess. That's all we gotta do. Take too long. Just imagine you're watching TV and some random kid comes and turns it off trying to steal your chair. I can understand why she's pissed. Man. She had way too much TV. She lost her face. Oh fuck, I'm screwed. What? <laughs> I 
I hate this mission so much. No, what the fuck? No, no. Oh my god, it's so scary. Is this how the iPad kids is gonna look like in 50 years? I don't know, man. I really don't know. I'm doing this too quick. I need her to like stay longer. I thought she's gonna get me, man. How far do I need to push it, actually? Did we get it? Man, we got it! Oh my god! After 1000 years... Man, if Billy was here, we could just... Ask him to give a, us a lift. Yeah, man. Oh my god. Finally. Oh, there's a whole party of them watching television. Man, I'm kind of jealous. I'd like to watch something with friends together, like a watch party. Speaking of watch parties, do you... Do you guys, like, with your friends, do you like to meet and watch movies? Man, what the hell? Can we just pass through them? Nah. That's messed up. Hey, no problem, man. Seriously. It's just fun to, to chat. At 9 your time. I don't even think I'm gonna stream for that long. I don't know, I started like streaming for very short. Sometimes I just do one hour. Oh, there's electricity here. Mmm. So that's the game we're gonna be playing now. called avoid being cooked actually no I don't know anything about Outlast Trials other than than uh, I noticed like it shows on Steam or Discord that you are playing it but I've never played it myself is it like custom made uh, scenarios by people in the Outlast universe that would be my guess. Okay, we can't push this. However, we can climb on this. Wow. So turn off the TV. There's water everywhere. There are a lot like levels that you need to complete. It's like an experimental training for secret agents during the Cold War. All right. I'd love to watch someone else play it and see for myself if I would like it. But knowing the fact that it's a horror game, I can assume I'm gonna like it. Aha, I see the power switch.
However, I don't know if we can get there. Wait, what? Did we enter through here so they're not allowing us to return? Yes, I did play Outlast. I don't remember which one, but Outlast is good. Very immersive game. It's like you, as a detective, you come to this hospital, and I think they are like. As far as I remember, they uh, they do a project of creating a superhuman called Billy. Shopping cart's gonna save me. Huh. It's up to four players. Okay. Outlast was definitely scary, at least when I played it. Fucking finally. No more electricity. Do I even need to be here? Well, that's cool. Oh wait, we probably do need the electricity still, for some reason. What the hell am I supposed to do here, man? This is so weird. I feel like we'll need a television. So <coughs> there's a ball. Maybe we can just leave the window. Well, it's oh no. Yeah, this is a lot scarier than the trials, though. The trials are more. Fast paced and all kind of stuff. Like throwing bottles and bricks at enemies instead of being able to run away from them. I mean, I think that's like a multiplayer thing. To like charge maybe, and be more fast. At least when you play other games such as like Phasmophobia, you are more likely to be reckless than you would be playing alone. Okay, so what is going on here, actually? I have no clue how to get through this. Let me take this down. Oh, nice. Where are you going? Come back. Maybe that's what I have to do, just like build myself a pathway to... ...to the TV.
think this is gonna be enough. Should we test it? Okay, this is also water. Need to place it a little bit better. Something like this, maybe even. Can I like jump from here? Well, that was a very bad jump. Okay, and from here we just jump on the TV with the. Well, it's nice to see that like things don't change, that you still enjoy horror games as much as you used to. Oh man, snacks, that sounds great. Could use some snacks as well. Right, turn time to turn on the electricity. I really hope I have settled everything correctly. Let's bring it back, baby. Try to reach the TV. Man, if they're gonna make me do this all over again just because I will be bad at platforming, I'm gonna be so sad. Come on, seriously, it happened. Just as I said it. Okay, so... What's the situation now? I don't really want to take anything. Thank you very much. I had to greet you from my mom. Thank you very much. That's very, very sweet. Ah, oh, this sucks. I have to redo everything. How's your mom doing? Let's try this again. You can place it like this and hopefully I won't miss the depth perception. Though it's very tricky. Yeah, it's very tricky. Oh boy, it's gonna be very, very tricky. Maybe we can find a nice spot that it's easy to like just jump straight forward. I mean, you're both like all after work and everything, so I would assume it's nice time to wind down and chill. What do you guys actually like to do to just like uh, relax and chill? Like uh, watch movies, 
Because I know you also watch a lot of movies with your family. Okay, I think I got it. Let's hope I will not die. That would be very sad. Oh god, we fell. Ooh, cards! Like simple cards, or do you have any something like a uh, specific board card game? <coughs> Me and Osha, we uh, recently played a card game called Disney Villainous. It's actually a very fun game because you play as Disney villains, villains, and. Uh, your job is to actually fulfill your evil desire. So the way you play the game is like you have everyone has their own objective, depends on who you play as. For example, like Aladdin Jafar, he has to open the cave of wonders and get his wishes and stuff and take over the palace. So you play your cards so that you would succeed, but you can uh you need to win against opponents, right? So what you do, you try to sabotage your opponent. So if me and Osha are playing, I have to like put hero cards that she has to fight against that the heroes are trying to stop her. So we're kind of we're trying to do our own thing, but also summon heroes to sabotage each other so that it would be harder to achieve. So it's fun. Oh, you've been playing Exploding Kittens. I know the game, but I haven't played it myself. Me and my friends were playing uh, Four Souls. It's a game by Edmund McMiller. Is that his name? The guy who made the Binding of Isaac. I don't know if he actually played that game, but the card game is super good. Yeah, it is a lot of fun. Now, Binding of Isaac probably is not a very family-friendly game, because it looks very... Uh, ...gory. I fucking hate this game. What the hell? It was perfect! Fucking... Yeah, I remember streaming it a little bit. I'm not a very huge fan of it myself, because I don't enjoy bullet hell games as much. Which game? Uh, Little Nightmares 2? Hi, by the way. Man, this fifth part is making me rage, because... I just keep losing because of depth perception. I cannot aim it correctly to jump over to the television. So it's becoming to be a little annoying. Come on, come to me. Okay, maybe pushing it will be easier instead of pulling. Let's try to keep it a bit closer to the TV. I don't know. It's too deep in 3D, so it makes things tricky. 
Yeah, I suppose so. At least I know I'm doing it correctly, it's just that... It's kind of punishing when it loads a checkpoint and you have to do everything again. I even tried, like, training. Jump from here. Yeah, it looks perfect again, but I'm gonna mess it up once electricity is running. But yeah, dude, we should either play a game together or just uh, call one day and chat. Because uh, it's really cool to chat with you during streams, just messages, but it's also really nice to hear your voice and respond instantaneously. Okay, we did it. Oh my freaking god. Get me out of here. Oh, Jesus Christ. Fuck you, TV. Never again. Yeah, I'm down. Could be fun. Wait, what? Oh, we're on the other side. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Look at this TV. Can we turn it on? Let me see if I can lure these guys. I don't know if that's something I wanted to do, but... Oh, 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 oh. Whoa, no, no, he actually opened the door. Okay, okay, okay. Oh my fucking god. I didn't expect this to be a chase scene. I didn't expect this to be a chase scene. Man. Even the music is like, oh my god, run. Damn, this is epic. Okay. Uh, they're really mad at me for taking the TV. Okay, go through. Oh my god, look at all the TVs! Are we good? Oh my god! Oh shit, we did it! Oh man! Oh Jesus, this looks amazing! Too bad Billy was not there to see this. I wonder if we're gonna get to see the Slender Man again. By the way, dude! You played Little Nightmares, right? Did you understand the story? The story is just so whimsical, I have no idea what's going on. Oh, <gasps> Billy! You're on the other side, man! Let me take you. Come on, bro! We're gonna save you! No, the Slenderman! Oh, man! Oh, he's gonna come out. Of course he's coming out. Slenderman! Do I have to chop him? Oh, I have to chop the door. Oh, I'm so dead. 
Oh man. Nah, I doubt that I can make anything about it. Man, this is epic. Spark is so fucked up. Come on, I have a door to chop. Chop, chop, run. I love how conveniently the axe just falls down. Man, come on! Alright, let's go. No, don't kill me now. Don't kill me now. Oh, he actually has the face. Damn, son. Yeah, I did play Little Nightmares 1. I didn't get anything there as well. It was pretty scary to see, like, the... The main character eat creatures, characters, dude. Oh no! Oh no! I'm not here. Go away. Thank you very much. didn't save Billy, sadly. Are we good? Are we safe? Oh man, no we're not. I have to bring the chair. Man! Why me? It's so slow! Oh my god, how scary this is. And I still need to break the door. Like the... No, I'm dead. He's gonna get me. Yep. Where are we now? Okay, we have time. Now we know we have to bring this. Now I have much more time. Okay. Good. We passed. Where do we go now? Okay. We're on the train, I think. Are we? Yeah, we are. Let's hope we got rid of the Slenderman. Oh, Slendy's coming to town. He's gonna kill me. Of course he's here. Welcome. Great. Leave me alone, please. Boy, well, he just teleports at some moments. I don't know why, like, skipping a frame is always so scary. Oh, he got me. Yep. How much more until the end of the chapter? Perspective is so confusing. Repeat. Jump. Nothing special, just run straight. so close no 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 <sighs> ok 
Okay, at least we got a checkpoint actually. Well, I'm gonna try to play the whole chapter. Okay, let's connect the train. Let's go! Bye, Slender! Look at him just watching us. Oh, hey, Sandra! It's such a long time! I'm so surprised to see you. Hello, welcome, welcome. You call him Mr. Hatman? We call him either the Slenderman or I called him Bane. If you know Star Wars, then you'll understand what I mean by saying Bane. The Hatman is lore accurate? Could be. Oh, we know not doing so swell. Is this a new chapter maybe? The Thin Man. Huh. That's an odd name for the guy. I think the Hat Man sounds better. Or he could be Daddy Long Legs. It's pretty spooky, I agree. We're following Billy. It's kind of funny that you can collect hats in this game. Like, sir, you're not my father. <laughs> and then you run from him. Imagine him just snatching us right now. Oh, wonderful! S something's big up ahead of us. Oh, hello! Of course he's here. Well, that's the end, I guess. What the hell is happening? Are you just surrendering? No, do something, man! Oh my god! Dope. Do I actually have to fight him? I guess I have to do something, but I'm not sure. I'm just watching. Go back! Back from where you came from, demon! This house! Oh my god. Oh, he's down. <laughs> you got an ad. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's so weird that ads still play on my channel, even though they're completely turned off. Oh man, you know, look so good. You know, look so good no more. That's right. Get back to your TV world. And now we're gonna become the next actor. Batman. What a 
what's happening. I'm confused. We shall open the door. Grab the hat? Can I actually grab the hat? Damn. I thought there was going to be a collectible. No, you're cute. <laughs> okay. Bottom right? Doesn't look like I can see any hats. Oh well. I could... No, I can't put on the hat. Okay, never mind. Is it the end? There was a hat, I couldn't see it. Seriously. Is this a new area? Oh, the Dutch tilts. This is so freaking eerie. Why am I not flying? Don't close the door on me, no! I feel rejected. Well, when one door closes, another one opens. Just like my mom always told me. Man, I'd love to sit on a couch and just rotate all day. Perfect. Perfect vacation time. It's a very cool drawer. Nice design. Hydrate. Oh boy, I have nothing to hydrate. Like a water droplet of cola. I have to go get cola. Wow. Is this some sort of code? <laughs> Your favorite activity rotating on the couch. Yeah, that's awesome. You get to appreciate couch time. I always say like, when you sit down on the couch, you relax so well that just like the gap in between the couch just sucks you in like... <laughs> Where's the music coming from? How many times do I have to go? Okay, we have to do something else here, I think. Interesting. Haha, <laughs> I'm in both places. Can I close one of the doors? <laughs> nice. Actually, this could work too. No, 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 stop it, kiddo. Stop it. I want to close it. I think I have to close the door. There we go. Run! Did I mess? No fucking! Oh man. Nice. 
No! It's more entertaining that way. What is happening here? My thought was like, I'm gonna close this and try to enter and then it stops the cycle. But that's not the case because it just opens up immediately. I think I'm gonna ask very soon because I'm getting very much so stuck. There's another door. It's insane if this door actually works. I'm trying to like jump on the door handle, but I don't know if that's even possible. Okay, you can tell me what to do. Was I doing something correctly? Like... I thought this is like it. But I don't jump sideways. I guess we have to follow the music. I can't hear music now. Okay, it's there. Well, that was cool. Oh, of course you did that to me. Evil. Is this the door I could not open? hear the music but we cannot go here can we what where to go now okay By the way, is this the new chapter? I'm gonna go back to the main menu just to check. Let's see the chapter selection. Yeah, this is the new chapter. So I think I'm gonna leave this for later, because, oh, it's a bit exhausting. Well, this was fun. We finished the Pale City today. I think it's called the Pale City. I have no idea. But hey, friends, thank you for joining me today. It was so nice to see you, Lollapo and Sandra, here. And um, I wish you a good weekend, I suppose. So thanks again, and bye-bye.